So when you have a keynote ready to present it, you can just tap on the play button and that will quickly present it and you just swipe through your text and pinch to zoom out. There is an option to present your keynote as well. So you have the option in here, which is rehearse slideshow, which can be useful. So if I rehearse my slideshow, I have additional options. So if I tap here, I can actually draw on my keynote at the same time. So if I'm tapping here, now these won't save. These are just maybe highlighting something like that. Um, or if I just click undo, it could be highlighting. Yeah, we're on the third one here. Or I could have a pointer, which is useful um, in there. So once I'm done, that will remove. The other option that you have is one that I use all the time for presenting and it is the option to show the layout. So you have a layout of current, which will just show this current slide. It will show you the next slide, which I don't actually use because I get mixed up between current and next when I'm doing them. One I do use is current and next. So I can see where I am and where I'm going, which is good when you're trying to do, um, get your thoughts in line. Current and notes is also useful because if you have speaker notes, I'll show you how to add them in in a moment. Um, that, that will just bring your notes up. You have next and notes and you have notes only. You also have the option to change the text if you want or invert the colors. So those are some options to be aware of. Once you're in there, you can just uh, tap your way through. We're just gonna go current and notes. I don't have any notes in this particular one, but I would in my regular presentations. So what you can do if you're looking for speaker notes is if you tap up here, show presenter notes. So I would have my notes and I would normally yeah have my notes in there and I'd be able to present them. So if I had this one, for example, I could have a prompt, um, maybe just to remind me to what I say on that one. And I go to rehearse my slideshow and I have my notes on the side and I have my slide there. And that is how I would present um, on Keynote.